Check this out. You guys sing my songs, you get to sleep here. Awesome! Sweet! Was this project pretty much a no-brainer for all you guys? For me, yes, it was, absolutely. They called and said, we want you above and beyond any other actor in Hollywood, and I said, of course, I'll be there. <laughs> no, but because, I mean, is it like, did, did, you guys were all around for at least one version of it. Yeah, I, I was there for Chipmunk Punk in 1980 and, and when it came back in the early 80s. Um, yeah, I mean, they call you for something like this, you know, you, you say yes, it's it's iconic, and, you know, it's it's now for a new generation, including my four-year-old son, and so, yeah, I was very happy to do it. Well, first of all, David Seville was, was really important because you have to find somebody who not only looks like David Seville, the dark hair, but also had a sense of music, a wonderful sense of physical comedy, which Jason does, and also has that natural appeal so that he can yell, Alvin! Obviously, Ross, this has been a part of his life. You since know, he was born. Since he mm -hmm. was born. Talk to me about what that's like to work with someone who, I mean, these are kind of like his brothers, you know? <laughs> I, I hear what you're saying, and I agree. Ross is mentally disturbed. <laughs> He's um, become a chipmunk. I, you said it very diplomatically, and I, I, yeah. I respect that. Um, I think at this point, Ross truly believes that chipmunks can talk. <laughs> I think it's gone beyond like a bit and a little little novelty for right. the show. I think he genuinely believes it. Well, because I was thinking about that, especially for you three, that he'd probably be in there like, no, theater doesn't feel that way. Was yeah. it a little bit like that? It was actually kind of comforting, yeah, because I, I think it's rare that you have a, a family that still owns the rights to, like, I, I know with the Dr. Seuss estate, it's sort of gotten lost in the mix, but having him, like, really there on the couch to to tell you exactly how it is, and Janice as well as wife. And also, they're the original voices, so it was kind of, yeah. Yeah. you know, very fright. I, at least for me, I don't want to screw it up. So the feedback was helpful? Yeah. Oh, yeah. To yeah, try to keep something. it authentic. Tell me, uh, what do you, what would you say are the common denominators between all the different versions we've had now over the last 50 years of the chipmunks? What would you say in this version, what are the common denominators? I think that they're still chipmunks. <laughs> is probably yeah. the main one. They're still three. They're still three. They still have the same names. They're still, they're still very still lovable. Furry. Yeah. Still yeah, cute, cuddly. Yes. Love nuts still. Sexually yeah. ambiguous. They still, still experimenting. <laughs> still, uh, <laughs>